All right, gonna do a little walkthrough of the two bedroom home that we have to rent in Nantucket. It's on Fairhaven Cove. It's a beautiful retirement street. You have to uh, be essentially retired, no kids, living in a small cul-de-sac immediately adjacent to the lake and the park at Nantucket. The house is uh, in incredible shape. It's beautiful, two bedroom. Two bath. The mom's lived in the house for 15 years since we built it for her. And she is now moving to a different location. So I thought I'd kind of walk you through it. Everything's been just immaculately taken care of. The house will come unfurnished. It's currently furnished with my mom's things right now. But uh, It'll at least give you a good idea of what it will look like with your furniture. To the left, we have a small alcove area with a closet, a closet, very nice, hall bath, full bath shower, with lots of storage, some cabinets and storage. Immediately to the left, we have the front bedroom. It's a very good sized bedroom. It's uh, about 10 by 14, 13, really nice size with a, an oversized closet. Very nice oversized closet. A lot of light in the house, oversized windows with um, beautiful level or wood blinds. Lots and lots of light in the house, which is really very nice. Walk into the den area, living room area. Plenty of room, even for a piano. <laughs> Very, really comfortable living space. Again, lots of, lots of light, lots of windows. Off to, uh, off to the back of the house. There's a beautiful deck um, area that sort of opens up onto a small creek. We'll walk out there in a second. So the master living or master bedroom. It's a really nice sized room. Again, a couple of windows. The really nice sized full bath. Shower combo. Very large walk in closet with a rack for. Shoes, gotta have the rack for shoes. Overhead storage as well. Really nice dining room area. It's a formal size dining table. You even have room for a china hutch there if you like. Really nice galley sized kitchen or galley style kitchen. We have a really nice laundry room off of the kitchen, not in the garage, which makes it kind of nice too. Let me hit the light. Nice to be able to do your laundry in the house. Lots and lots of storage, even another closet for hanging things up and storing the vacuum cleaner or whatnot. Very nice sized walk-in pantry for a small house. Lots and lots of room for storage, food storage and even put a, an extra stool away. Walk out on the back patio and we'll do a little tour of the backyard. This is coming from the uh, side of the house. Nice rows of Sharon there. Again, it's just too much yard for my mom to maintain. It's in beautiful condition right now, even though it's August or September. Um, everything's in, in really nice shape back here. It's a little creek. It's a wildlife. No raccoons, possums, yeah. <laughs> if you're looking for a uh, really comfortable home with close access to College Station and a lake nearby to fish at and a deck to sit on to. Look at the birds and enjoy your lifestyle. This is the house for you. We'll walk out on the deck now. Deck is a really nice feature of this house.
Beautiful patio and wood deck off the back. Opening up onto a green space. A house on the other side of the creek there, but tons and tons of birds out here. My mom regularly sits in the, uh, the swing there and feeds the birds out in the yard and watches the uh, cardinals and the finches and hummingbirds. And in the spring, there's all kinds of colors. It's a great myrtle over there on the left. There's oleanders, arborvitae, all kinds of really, really beautiful plants in the yard.